अच्छा ठीक है तो वॉट वी कैन डू इज की फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी कैन डिस्कस एंड देन वेन यू गेट द क्वेश्चन मैं ट्राई टू गूगल सर्च इट गूगल सर्च द क्वेश्चन कॉम्प्रेंसिवली ठीक है यस ओके तो द फर्स्ट थिंग इज दैट की दैट यू नीड टू प्रिपेयर इन योर इंटरव्यू फॉर योर इंटरव्यू इज योर ओन नेम ओके तो मीनिंग ऑफ योर नेम वॉट हैव यू लर्न फ्रॉम दैट हाउ हैव यू अप्लाइड दैट इन योर लाइफ वॉट कैन यू ब्रिंग फ्रॉम दैट टू सिविल सर्विस ठीक है नेक्स्ट थिंग इज prominent personalities by that name their contribution to public life what have you learned from them and how can you apply that and what can you bring from that to civil service yes sir uh after that they can go into your date of birth and the date of your interview so anything important that happened on the date of your birth and the date of your interview will become important by default if it pertains to indian history geography economy politics culture other than that you can go to wikipedia and you can find the list of important events that happened on the date of your birth and the date of your interview ठीक है उसके बाद फिर हाँ नेक्स्ट थिंग कैन बी अच्छा यू कैन वेन यू गो टू विकीपीडिया यू कैन पिक एंड चूज द टॉपिक दैट यूर कम्फर्टेबल टॉकिंग अबाउट सो दैट गुड गुड वे फॉर यू टू डाइवर्ट द कॉन्वर्सेशन इन योर एरियाज ऑफ इंटरेस्ट नेक्स्ट थिंग कैन बी योर होम स्टेट तो यू हैव हैदराबाद तेलंगाना एज योर एड्रेस फॉर करस्पॉन्डेंस एज वेल एज Permanent address and DAF two me you have mentioned Jangao, Telangana. Okay, so whenever there are places in your DAF, you need to prepare on the lines of society, geography, economy, polity, history, culture, current affairs, and then the salient issues. For example, for Telangana, salient issues can be regarding uh, heat waves, disaster management, or water conservation key initiatives by Kakatiyas or mission yes. Kakatiya. Status of that. Okay. then they can also go into they can also go into uh, bifurcation how has it been for the two daughter states then special category status then they can also go into uh, disaster management initiatives by the state government district government uh, district administration state government and then by the central government so what is the role of uh, then what is the role of uh, district administration in that then how does that uh, how does the district administration prepare for that uh, pre post and during disaster how is the sindai framework working so prevention mitigation response recovery yes then the reasons for development of it industry pearl industry in hyderabad how is charminar a symbol of secularism yes sir then musi river what has been the reasons for its uh, for its degradation and what are the problems of telangana what has been the district, uh, what has been the state government doing then uh, greyhound model for countering nationalism what is the status of nationalism okay then ranking of telangana in indices of central government geographical indicators of indication indicators in telangana geographical indications okay uske baad fir ranking of telangana in state uh, ranking of telangana in indices of central government like whichever is relevant the state city or district ranking in different indices either state is ranked or city is ranked or district is ranked yes. then there is green hills colony in your address so yes. that you study about environment conservation forest rights act biodiversity act forest conservation act recent amendments in that green india mission circular economy sustainable development goals india's achievements in sustainable development goals yes sir then they can also go into indcs and achievements india as uh, achievements made by india and progress towards achieving the goal paris deal cop 28 outcomes uns yes. kyoto protocol then your optional subject you have mentioned is sociology theek hai so what have you learned from sociology that you can bring to administration do you think that indian society is becoming more individualistic and materialistic what are the major fault lines in indian society theek okay. hai after that they can ask you regarding major thinkers in sociology okay so ha huh, to initiative initiative second by the government of india for the welfare of scheduled castes and scheduled tribes so marginalized section of society ke welfare ke liye what initiatives have been taken theek hai yes मार्जिनाइज सेक्शंस ऑफ सोसाइटी के लिए व्हाट इनिशिएटिव्स हैव बीन टेकन देन लाइक शेड्यूल कास्ट शेड्यूल ट्राइब सीनियर सिटीजन वुमेन चिल्ड्रन और डिफरेंट लेबल पीपल स्लम डवेलर्स डेस्टिट्यूट्स ठीक है
then they can also go into what are the fault lines in society do you think do you think intolerance is rising in the society or not that what are the values in sociology what can you bring from sociology to administration what is your opinion regarding prominent personalities and their contributions like talcott parsons and his view on socialism marx's idea of socialism fir uske baad is is marx still relevant in contemporary india what are german sociologists and their contribution what are, what is hegel's dialectics and what is the contribution of andre petel what is the contribution of jyotiba phule what are the books that was written by him okay how has sociology helped in evolution of your personality why did you use choose sociology as your optional when you are from civil civil engineering what is the impact of civil engineering on sociology can it promote inequality or can it reduce inequality okay so basically the commonality is areas of commonality between your subjects yes sir theek hai then uh, your father is a managing partner where in a construction company sir uh, own construction in a construction company theek hai so uh, we can uh, when we talk about civil engineering we can go into that as well other than that acha theek hai to civil engineering se uh, before we do that we can talk about maths physics and chemistry so recent developments in maths physics and chemistry ठीक है तो हुए वन द नोबेल प्राइज हुए वन द फ्रीज मेडल व्हाट आर द एप्लीकेशंस ऑफ देयर थ्योरी इकोनॉमिक जियो पॉलिटिकल जियो स्ट्रेटजिक इंप्लीकेशंस इफ एनी देन श्री चैतन्य जूनियर कलाशाला तो हु वाज श्री चैतन्य व्हाट वाज हिज कंट्रीब्यूशन टू सोशल रिफॉर्म और रिलीजियस रिफॉर्म व्हाट वाज व्हाट वाज द मेजर लिटरेचर रिटन बाय हिम ठीक है आफ्टर दैट सिविल इंजीनियरिंग दे टेंड टू आस्क प्रैक्टिकल एप्लीकेशन ओरिएंटेड क्वेश्चंस यस he they are not going to ask you about equations or moment area method they are going to ask you about uh, why is there so much corruption in civil engineering when buildings get uh, why why do buildings get tilted why do cracks develop in buildings yes sir theek okay. hai why do cracks develop in buildings how will you ensure that what how uh, why why do buildings made uh, these years don't survive for long when ancient era buildings have survived for hundreds and thousands of years what will you bring from civil engineering to civil service yes sir okay then yes. after that they can ask you regarding what can yes. we do to promote industry academy or linkage why is updation of is codes not as frequent or as regular in civil engineering what can you do for what has the government of india done for worker welfare in civil engineering फिर उसके बाद नेक्स्ट थिंग कैन बी लेटेस्ट डेवलपमेंट्स इन सिविल इंजीनियरिंग हाउ कैन सिविल इंजीनियरिंग प्रमोट कंट्रीब्यूट टू सस्टेनेबल डेवलपमेंट हाउ कैन सिविल इंजीनियरिंग कंट्रीब्यूट टू काउंटर क्लाइमेट चेंज हाउ कैन वी रिड्यूस द इंपैक्ट ऑफ कंस्ट्रक्शन इंडस्ट्री लेटेस्ट डेवलपमेंट्स इन सिविल इंजीनियरिंग लाइक पोल्यूशन ईटिंग बिल्डिंग्स शेप शिफ्टिंग बिल्डिंग्स ब्रीदेबल बिल्डिंग्स और शेडोलेस बिल्डिंग सिवियोनिक्स प्रोग्रामेबल सीमेंट सेल्फ हीलिंग कॉन्क्रीट दे कैन ऑल्सो गो इन what can you bring from civil engineering to civil services was actually asked to me in the interview uh yes sir uh like with the respect to this question hmm. do we need to tell the usage of the principles or else the application or uh, like if there's a infra infrastructure project i would be better positioned to understand the question you can answer the technical aspect as well as the non technical aspect uses of principles and application is the same thing okay so that is not different but technical aspects like uh, uh, maybe construction construction technology or maybe irrigation engineering or transportation and traffic engineering or maybe contribution to uh, disaster management these are all technical stuff but they they can definitely ask you ki we already have engineers for that why do we need you right yes, so sir. but you need to mention the non technical aspects as well like factor of safety frugality simplicity citizen centricity punctuality leadership yes. all these things you can bring from civil engineering to civil service you need to explain how you learned these in civil engineering and how you learn how, what you can apply to say how, how you can apply these to civil services then uske baad you were employed in cap gemini technology so what were you consulting upon what would you uh, what would you be able to bring from your experience in consulting to civil service or why would you what can you bring from private sector to civil service in terms of technology or work ethic or in terms of uh, team building activities whatever may be may have been your experience yes sir. you want to come and what can you bring and what was your learnings when you were working in a particular sector basically so uh, you should be able to talk at length about that sector in terms of laws policies schemes current affairs 
so in terms of work ethic and culture what can you bring about the sector that you are working in and why do you want to come these are the three important questions that can be asked then about it the best white paper during internship at cat gemini so what was that white paper about so which sector you were working in yeah. that yes that is a prominent question the first prize in a national marketing competition conducted at iaft so how will you use your experience of marketing to promote government of india ki schemes what is social marketing what are the dark patterns that are being used in marketing what are the challenges that uh, brick and mortar stores are facing from e-commerce companies what is the e-commerce policy of government of india then you can mention ki first prize in national marketing competition conducted at iaft gold medal in a freestyle presentation competition conducted by ouce what is iaft indian institute of foreign trade sir foreign trade okay so initiatives taken by government of india for promotion of trade or exports foreign trade policy salient provisions of that major trade partners major trade pro major products that are traded what is the bottleneck because of which you are not able to promote exports is it the logistics or is it the customs procedure or is it the quality of products or is it the cost or is it the ftas recently negotiated ftas in which sectors are we facing competition from neighboring countries because of the ftas they have negotiated what are the foreign trade agreements that we have been negotiating recently okay then what is ouce uh college of engineering sir usmani university college of engineering acha theek hai and you have done masters as well in foreign trade so international yeah. international business marketing strategy and then institute of foreign trade delhi iaft is that theek hai so they can ask you regarding compare and contrast the life in hyderabad and delhi i was asked this question the compare and contrast the social structure of bhopal and kanpur so so you should be ready with the aspects like society geography economy polity history culture current affairs then managed hostel and mess committee as a member of student council so what were the initiatives what were the challenges that you faced how did you manage the hostel like what uh, uh, what were the initiatives that you took for physical health mental health vocational education skill development social capital or, or building of team spirit value education for students then what were the challenges that you faced as the mess committee member when you tried to uh, work in maybe reduction of food wastage what initiatives did you take for reduction of food wastage what was the inventory management principle that you followed was it based on some software or was it based on regular monitoring okay then what yeah. cost cutting measures did you introduce can you get energy from composting of uh, you can get energy from composting of food wasted food or did you implement these initiatives or not then how can we test the presence of adulterants in food what are the natural preservatives of food what is the balanced diet for young people who young people who have an active uh, physical exercise or senior citizens who cannot exercise properly so what is the balanced diet for them what is optimal cooking temperature for carbohydrates proteins fats minerals then what are trans fats theek hai uske baad then what is punch for in cooking what are the salient dishes and cuisines of your state theek hai then what is fssai what is its role in safe uh, in ensuring safety in food uh, food consumption in india sir organize a technical fest as convener of ouc so as the as the uh, organizer of the technical fest what were the team members that you needed maybe in hospitality marketing finance publicity security accounts event organization like event heads so what was the budget of that what were the milestones what were the timelines what were the challenges what were the lessons how did you overcome those challenges then you facilitated organization of guest lectures as an executive member of civil engineering association so what were the guest lectures did you organize that you organized then new education policy salient provisions of the education policy initiatives taken to promote industry academia linkage theek okay. hai then coming to your hobbies traveling and jumping rope enthusiast so which places have you traveled to recently what did you learn from that theek okay. hai which places have you which places have you traveled to what have you learned what have been the initiatives taken by government of india for promotion of tourism theek okay. hai 
स्वदेश दर्शन स्कीम मे बी स्वदेश दर्शन स्कीम प्रसाद हृदय एक्सेट्रा देन वाई इज इट दैट वाई इज इट दैट वी हैव लेस टूरिस्ट फुटफॉल कंपेयर टू इवन स्मॉलर आईलैंड स्टेट्स पर कैपिटल नॉट टोटल बट पर कैपिटल ठीक है आफ्टर दैट देन what will you do to promote tourism digitally then uh, you should be able to comment on the aspect of society geography economy polity history culture current affairs jumping rope enthusiasts so whenever there are sports in your diet you need to prepare on the lines of uh, rules and regulations history strategic evolution technique technology personality the associated initiatives of promotion of sports in general and initiatives of promotion of sports in particular and major events organized at the national level and international level performance of india in international events performance of india performance of your state and national level events what have you learned from that sport initiatives taken for uh, uh, improving the performance of india in olympics target olympic podium khelo india scheme how is that working yes sir then coming to your cadre preference acha if you were the sports secretary of your state if you were the sports minister or minister of youth and sports affairs how would you have promoted sports this can also be a question then coming to your cadre preferences here aapka cadre preferences telangana telangana maharashtra rajasthan telangana maharashtra rajasthan uttar pradesh and west bengal telangana maharashtra rajasthan uttar pradesh west bengal theek hai ips mein is it the same telangana maharashtra agmut तेलंगाना महाराष्ट्र एक्मुट उत्तर प्रदेश एंड वेस्ट बंगाल फिर आई ए एस आई पी एस आई एफ एस इनकम टैक्स कस्टम्स ऑडिट देन सेवेंथ इज रेलवे मैनेजमेंट एट इज सिविल अकाउंट नाइन्थ इज डिफेंस अकाउंट ठीक है सो दैट इज प्रिटी मच इट फ्रॉम माई साइड इफ दिस एनीथिंग दैट यू वॉन्ट टू आस्क और डिस्कस यू कैन आस्क otherwise we can conclude the session and you can send me the keywords of your data so your question mark can be made yes sir well, nothing specific sir the, the i was having doubt with regards to uh, like if they ask a question uh, like suppose you are from management background and what will you apply from your learnings uh, oh. this is the question that i am feeling trouble sir do we need to use the principles or else application based uh, from their question interpretation both like i gave you an example for civil engineering yes sir okay what you learned uh, how has it changed your personality understood okay so what changed your personality and how are those learnings applicable in civil service yes I even gave you an example so you can think on those lines right yes the technical aspects and non technical aspects non technical aspects mein the philosophy behind it and technical aspects mein the principles and application yes sir theek hai yes sir Hello. Then anything else? Uh, no, sir. That's it, sir. So okay. Then good luck. Take care. Do make sure that you send me the keywords of your dad. Yes, sir. Yeah.